Hello, my name is Gitas Baranauskas and I'm an ENT surgeon here at Nord Aesthetics. Why do people want a nose job? Nose job might be for aesthetic reasons and it might be for functional reasons. Also, it might be a combination of the two before mentioned. If a patient wants only to get their facial appearance improved, we offer surgery called a rhinoplasty. This surgery only improves the shape of the nose, but it does not touch the functional issues of the nose. If the patient wants to get their function improved, then we might offer a septoplasty or a septorhinoplasty, which sometimes might be called a functional rhinoplasty. Rhinoplasty might be done in two different ways. There are two different approaches. One is a closed approach when the incisions are only inside of the nose and the open approach is approach when the full skin envelope of the nose is elevated which means that there will be a scar underneath the nose in the calumella. How to prepare for rhinoplasty? First, you have to do quite a good research and you have to find the doctor that you would trust Few opinions of few different doctors are also encouraged. When you are ready for rhinoplasty, you have to understand that the final result of your nose job will be visible only about after a year. If it is a revision rhinoplasty or so-called secondary rhinoplasty, the result might be visible only in about one and a half, maybe two, three years. If you are considering a rhinoplasty, you should stop taking your herbal supplements, you should stop smoking, you should stop uh, drinking alcohol. Also, it is encouraged to stop using any anti-inflammatory drugs if you're taking any. Aspirin is also forbidden. Right before the surgery, you should be for eight hours on empty stomach. Uh, you should have a good shower in the morning and uh, well, just be ready for your journey. The post-operative time for a rhinoplasty, the worst are the first three days. After that, your, your life starts to get better. For first week, you are wearing a cast on the outside of the nose. There are also silicone sheets inside in your nose and uh, there are stitches in the calumella if the open approach was used. After one week, everything is removed. The nose is taped again so that there would be a compression on the skin envelope. This helps to reduce the swelling and to even all small irregularities that might occur after the surgery. The taping is recommended to use for about four to six weeks. After the surgery, it depends from the thickness of your skin. If your skin is very thick, then you should use the tape for about six weeks because the swelling might last a little bit longer than in thin skin patients. During this time, it is recommended to wash your nose with nasal saline and apply oil drops so that the inside of your nose would be moist and there wouldn't be any crusting or scabbing inside. If you have any additional questions about rhinoplasty, uh, feel free to contact us here at Nord Aesthetics.